what's up guys code 103 here and I am back again with another tutorial this time I will show you how to install scripts for Elsa PDFR so let's get started the first thing you need is obviously Elsa PDFR installed in GTA 4 game um, you do require Elsa PDFR to be installed because um, that's the program that's gonna put the scripts folder in your directory you can't do it manually so uh, once you have Elsa PDFR installed um, we'll install the scripts so go to your GTA 4 directory uh, like I said file explorer for me so for you guys would be uh, your computer my computer whatever you want to call it local disk uh, program files time 86 steam steam apps common grant the file 4 GTA 4 alright so right here you should have the scripts folder this one if you don't have it then uh, there's something wrong with your game then um, you should have it when you install the LCPFR well with the install of LCPFR as you can see I just installed LCPFR again so um, it's August 1st I just installed it right now so I just got this and if you double click it inside you'll see uh, LCPFR folder and the first response uh, script for LCPFR now uh, let's say you downloaded some scripts off of the website LCPFR and I'm saying LCPFR too much <laughs> um, um, and in this case I downloaded police helper uh, traffic flow and policing script so we'll install each one of those so let's double click it and as you can see right here here are the two scripts that we need so there's the readme if you want to read it it'll tell you what it can do how to install it um, and even how do you activate it I think I'm not sure if it tells you how to activate it no actually I think it does nope well I'm not sure you can you can read it yourself and it would say um, but yeah so what we can do here is open your scripts folder what you can do is just drag and drop which, there you go drag and drop or if you can't drag and drop um, try to extract it somewhere where it will be easy for you to find like a folder you know make a new folder name it uh, scripts and then just extract it there and then copy it over here um, so the police helper is done let's do the game again for uh, policing script and traffic flow it's pretty much the same thing just drag and drop there you go and traffic flow drag and drop so just drag and drop the scripts don't drag and drop anything else uh, both the scripts are only going to be an any file and a dll file and that's it oh that and dot net dot dll file and um if you double click on the any file it'll tell you some things um on some of these scripts you can actually edit the any file to your liking um, as you can see right here you know auto start true you can put that as false um, in this case uh, for police helper if it's on false you would need to start police helper manually which would be I think alt delete I think that's the key I'm not sure um, I don't really use it that much so I don't, I'm not sure and it'll tell you what keys you use to activate flares, road barriers, anything else you may need. Um, but yeah, guys, that's the way you install scripts. So I hope you guys learn how to do this. And so you guys can can use this uh, next time you want to install something. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching and see you later. Bye.